Hey guys, this video is special. I'm dedicating it to One Bride is Red. She's been a super fan for a really long time. She's watched every single video all the way through, which is a great way to support the channel. And she's even done a shout out on her own channel as well. I'll leave a link to her down in the description. And she wanted me to do a video involving the Digital Circus. So this is the Magnetized Digital Circus parts one, two, and three. So be sure to watch all three parts. I'm sure it only gets better as it goes. And I'm Chopsicle the Dog. Tell me I'm a good boy by liking the video. And I've got merch in the description as well. We've got the beginning of one of the Digital Circus characters. I'm not sure which one it is yet, though. Oh, that's because he's peeling off some of the, the marbles there. Or magnetic balls. Oh, I know who that's going to be. <laughs> of course. Of course, it's Kane. <laughs> He is like the announcer of the digital circus. He's got his eyes inside his mouth because just couldn't already be creepy enough that he's like one of those like wind up mouth toys. <laughs> All right. So we're building up. It looks really good, though. Oh, look at his outfit. We're probably going to be taking yeah that green off. And there we are putting together his feet. His legs looking dapper, looking really sharp. Got a lot of riz that cane. Okay, getting the bottom of the tuxedo going. And of course, the tuxedo has that missing spot in the back. Yep. There we go. We got to put his arms on. There he is. Oh, he's kind of like got it on his hip, holding his cane. Oh, his other arm. And now we get to put the head on. How's he gonna look? Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Kane looks amazing. Look at that. They did such a good job. Okay, who are we putting together now? Gosh, with that purple, that could be Jax, maybe? I don't know, though. It doesn't look like the right. Sh oh, it is. That's his head, actually. I thought it was going to be his body. <laughs> it's Jax. Okay, put his body together. He's got his suspenders. Nice. His overalls. And of course, that's going to be his arm. Very cool. Hand on his hip. And on his other hip, that's kind of the pose that we're used to seeing Jackson a lot. There he is. Look at that. That's really good. All right, next one. I wonder if they'll save Pomni for last. I'm guessing King Kinger. No, it is Pomni. No, Ragatha. That's who it is. Ragatha. There you go. Okay. Took me a second to figure that one out. Getting her dress together. Oh, I suppose they make it a little smaller to go into the waist and then they go back up for the bust. Very cool. Uh, her feet are together. It's kind of the way she stands. Yep, hands pointed out a little. Nice. Very good, Ragatha. I like that a lot. Look at her hair, the way they got just little bits hanging out here and there. That's so right. Okay, this will be Kinger. He's pretty much just a uh, chest piece. <laughs> oh, they squeezed in the waist a little bit. That's how they got that kind of like slimming effect there. There he is with his little hands sticking out the side. <laughs> okay. And the last, I think this will be the last one. It's going to be our Pomni. Am I right? Yes, absolutely. There we are. Yep, getting the hair going. Okay. Okay, and they're going to string these together, make them a little smaller each time again, I think. And that's going to become, yep, that peak of that hat. Kind of the jester hat that she wears. 
Okay, got to bend it. Yep. Very, that's cool the way they can get that to look like a real material kind of, you know. Nice, okay. Building the body of Pomni. So satisfying how these all snap together like that. Got to get her feet on there. Okay. Arms. Man, she's got a lot of colors going on. She's not an easy one, I don't think. That one probably took some planning. The buttons on her shirt. And put on her head. There she is. It's Pomni. <laughs> so good. Wow, this is the digital circus. This is the first episode. We're going to react to all three in this episode. So there they are. All right, on to number two. Let's go. So now we're on to episode two of the digital circus. Oh, what are we working on here? Is this going to be Zubal? I bet it will be. Okay, we've got, yes, there's the eye. You can tell by the shape of the head. It's like abstract art. So cool. Putting the body together. At least I think that's what it is. This character is so odd that you could probably like wait till the very end to really see what it's going to be. <laughs> Wow. Oh, that's the other leg. That's right. That one leg is just like a string. <laughs> oh, we're having it like sitting on a pedestal, I think, because there's no other way to make it stand up with limbs that skinny. OK, so they used white like it's just the background. And there's Zubal's head. They did such a cool job with that. <laughs> what a crazy character. And next is going to be Gangle. His face. It's kind of like one of those masks from like the theater performances. You see like one of them's like laughing and one's crying. It's kind of like that kind of mask. All right. So they've got it winding around the white there i think that's gonna be the same thing right like the white is supposed to blend into the background oh he's got the tears oh poor gangle all right that's gonna be his legs i guess with the mask being white it makes it a little tougher to tell but oh he's crying because the other broken mask oh man all right who's next I know there's Bubble, right? You know, this could be Bubble. Wow. I wouldn't have even thought they could make that character. But they're using just the regular silver balls. Okay. Gosh, that's got to be hard to make like a perfect circle like that. Look at that filling in each little hole. All right, they're going to take those off. All right, there's Bubble. <laughs> All right, putting together. What do we got now? What's this going to be? OK, OK. Putting on. Oh, is this the oh, the clown Kofmo, right? Yeah, Kafmo the Clown. I totally forgot about him. Of course, we got to have Kafmo. Oh, it looks so good. Putting together his arms. So let me know in the description who your favorite Digital Circus character is. And do you think they did a good job of that character? Wow, look at that. <laughs> we have so many Digital Circus characters now. This was part two. We're now going to do part three of Digital Circus. And this is Magnetized Digital Circus Into the Void.
Okay, so we're taking all of those characters that we built and monster magnets are destroying them. <laughs> Look at that. Oh no. Oh wow. <laughs> They're all going down, Jack. Come on, you gotta no, you gotta dodge it, Jack. Okay, bubble. You can dodge it, bubble. You're floating. Oh, he did. He got out of the way. Oh, and he got Kafo instead. <laughs> Oh, can Pomni make it out? No, she can't. <laughs> okay, Kane. Kane dodged it. <laughs> oh, no, it found him from above. As always, I left a link to the original in the description. I've got merch down in the description. And don't forget to tell me I'm a good boy by subscribing and liking the video.